All right, Shalom. Real Hebrew is like something that we can we can prophesy on the downfall of America and society. Starting off, I want to give all praise, all honor, and glory to Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh by Hashem, the truly powerful name, the royal ignorance calls God. Yahweh is the truly powerful name, the royal ignorance calls Jesus. By Hashem means in the name of Yahweh by Hashem, the spirit, literally translates to the holy. We call spirit with our holy. When you get double honors to my elders and apostles, we get no stone. We will and teach well and being ready as I'm to us, uncle brothers, and peace and blessed to the full echo of will and part and number. I'm the brother Kodar from the gym in Brand Chicago. Come back with another video. And it's from the Newsweek.com. It says Russia calls Israel, quote unquote, the problem in the Middle East. You know, defends Iran and its allies. All right, um, you know, you got Ezekiel 38. You know, hey, Russia is going to be a guard unto these nations. All right, and, and you know, of course, you know, is uh, you know the U.S. America is Israel's bitch. All right, all right, Israel is the pimp, and America is the prostitute. <laughs> all right, that's literally what it is, man. All right, and you know, hey, Esau is being made bare. You know, they being exposed, man. All right, you got Iran. You know, saying you know, uh, Iran said death to America. You know, and and America. You know, um, a lot of these countries like. About 85% of these countries don't even want Americans flying over to their country, man. You know, hey, uh, you Americans have a rude awakening coming to you, man. Because a lot of a lot of people hate you, man. All right? And, they, and, 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 you know, they cover it up by saying they hate the leadership. But, no, they hate you. They hate you as well, man. All right? And, and you know, they call Israel a problem, which, you know, it's true. Because they, they um, you know, cause ours. You know, um, the Amalekites over there, and you know, a the, the scriptures say when a real people of Israel was to go back to the land, there'll be peace on the earth, and that's obviously no peace on the earth, man. All right, the Lord said if He established us in the land of Israel again, all right, hey, we're gonna be in the second covenant, there's gonna be peace on the earth, man. Proverbs 29 and 2, man, all right, Romans the eighth chapter, okay, there's obviously no peace on this earth right now, so that just proves that they're not the children of the Lord, man, that alone. Along with many precepts I could bring out. That alone proves that they're not the children of the Lord, man. All right? They're imposters, man. Um, in a noteworthy interview with Israel's newspaper on Tuesday, Russia has accused Israel of being responsible for the unrest in the Middle East while relieving Iran and its allies of blame. All right? Because, you, know, um, you know, you got Palestine, you know, right in front of Israel. You know, right to the north of them, you know, and, and it, you know, it's constantly bombing, you know, Syria, Iran, you know, and Palestine. You know why? Because of fear of nuclear uh, weapons, man, you know. Um, keep reading. It's a lot. Okay, there we go. I'm not sure why it's doing that. It's a lot, yeah, I can. All right, it's not letting me scroll up. It says... The problem is, is, and the reason is not Iranian activities. Russia ambassador to Israel, I'm not going to read the name, told Jerusalem Post in comments later showed, shared by Moscow Embassy in Tel Aviv. All right? <laughs> you also have the biggest gay parade in Tel Aviv. This doesn't, does not the scripture uh, contradict that? All right? Does not the scripture uh, condemn that? Salah, uh, Salah, correction. Does not the, uh, the scripture condemn homosexuality? All right? And if they were true, if they were the true people of Israel, they'll be in the second covenant right now. It'd be peace on the earth, and they'll it'll be impossible for them to you know go off and be a homosexual. That just proved they're not the Lord's children, you know. It's a lack of understanding between countries and non-compliance with UN resolutions in Israel, Arab, and Israel-Palestinian conflict. All right. Israelis have steadily annexed and settled across territories deemed Palestinian by the United Nations. Violence between the two sides has st st stimulated peace efforts for decades. The friction between Israel and Iran, along with fellow pro-Palestinian partners such as Lebanese, Shifty, Muslim movement, Hezbollah, have taken proceedings, man. But Vic Victor dismiss Israeli concern of Hezbollah plots, such as infiltration, rockets attack, pointing instead to regular Israeli operations against the group and other suspected Iranian assets in countries like neighboring Syria. All right? It says Israel attacking Hezbollah. Hezbollah is not attacking Israel, Victoria said. All right? 
arguing there's no proof Hezbollah created the tunnels Israel have been uncovered it's along its contested northern border with Lebanon, man. All right. And I'm, a, I'm, a, uh, I'm not gonna read the whole thing. You know, I, I pretty much got the point. You know, y'all. Um, let me try to skim through a little bit and get the scriptures, cause that's what really matters. All right, I'm gonna read this last one. It says, "Victor of headed the call." He said, "Israel must not must." Quote unquote, not attack the territories of sovereign UN, UN members. He acknowledged that Israel gave Russia prior notice before such strikes because coordination is about the safety of the Russian military in Syria, but emphasized that there is no way that we are approving any Israeli strikes on Syria. Never in the past and never in the future, man. All right. This is Ezekiel 38. And the, and the word of Yahweh came unto me, saying, Son of man, set thy face against Gog in the land of Magog, and that's Russia. All right? The reason why the Lord said, Set thy face against them, because they Edomites as well. The chief prince of Meshach and Tubal had prophesied against them, and said, Thus saith the Lord Yahweh, behold, behold, I am against thee, O Gog, and chief prince of Meshach and Tubal. And I will turn thee back and put hooks in thy jaws. All right? And I will bring forth thine army, horses and horsemen. And all of them clothed with swords of armor, even a great couple of bucklers and shields, all of them handing the swords. All right, and I hook in the jaw because, you know, I wrote it down the con in the thing. It says, um, okay, con, you know, because I put it in the notes. It said, I put, when you, because I got the breakdown, you know, from the elves. When you catch a fish with, or tug and goes the other way, but the hooks draw them back, you know, dragging Russia into that hungry bear spirit, you know, because that's, that's their, um, you know, America, you know, they, I guess their country look, little animal, you know, it's like the eagle, you know, and Russia's is the bear, and it's spiritual as well, you know, because in the, you know, mid-70s, you know, like after the Cold War, you know, Russia was like in a peaceful time, you know, that, that symbolizes that hyper, hyper, um, hibernating spirit, but now, you know, when a bear wakes up after the hibernating spirit, hey, he hungry, man, and that's these Russians right now, you know. It says Persia and Ethiopia and Libya, all right? And Iran is modern-day Persia, man. Those are Elamites, all right? And with them, all of them, she was a helmet. And Gomer, all his bands, the house of Togarmoth in the north quarters, and all his bands and many people with thee. Be thou prepared and prepare thyself, and all thy coming at thou art assembled to thee, and be thou a guard unto them. So Russia will defend them, man, all right? You know, I just searched up, you know, war in Middle East. Um, it says, Israel tried to lure Iran into war with far facts of us killing, you know. You know, that could keep Trump in office, man, you know. But um, it don't matter who in office, man. You know, this place is going to be destroyed either way. But I want to give all praise, all honor, and glory to Yahweh, Shemal Shabbat, Shemachakudash, Shalom, and the Baba Ball.